Hi, I'm Andrew Brophy, and I'm doing some uh, questions for Skate Warehouse. Oh, I'm going to waste so much of your time. <laughs> was I putting girl stickers on my boards before I was on girl? Yes, I was definitely doing that. <laughs> I was foreshadowing it, trying to make it happen. And it fucking worked out somehow. I'm stoked. What's my best sticker job? And how do you manage to spend time with your family and have a skate career at the same time? My best sticker job is done by my six year old son. And Skating in between family time is just what it is. You make time for it, and spend time with the fam, and go skate. Do I like ketchup on my eggs? Depends on what type of morning I'm having. If I'm eating eggs, sometimes I will use ketchup or hot sauce. Could I beat Mike Carroll in an arm wrestle? I'm gonna say definitely. Sorry Mike, but I got you. How often do I have to correct people about being Australian or New Zealand? I never correct anyone if they think I'm New Zealander, I'll be a New Zealander. And if they think I'm Australian, I'm Australian. New Zealand's a shit, so I'm stoked to be from either. This is a good one. Kick flips or heel flips? Same thing, depends on the day, whatever one works. The majority of the time I'm failing at both, so whatever. What are the snakes like in America compared to the snakes in Australia? They're all snakes and poisonous and horrible, so all the same. Except you guys got rattlesnakes, we don't. Vegemite? Yes. Only a little bit with lots of butter. How old was I when I started skating? Probably 10. What was my first skateboard and how did I get it? I stole it from a friend at school. And it was blue and had only bits of grip tape on the nose and tail. And I said I was going to give him five bucks, but I never gave him five bucks, ever. Had yellow wheels too. It was the shit. Who would win in a fight out of a crocodile or a shark? I'm going to say a saltwater croc for sure. Those things are fucking ruthless. And bigger than sharks, and so I'm quite salty. The last time I wore Under Armour, I didn't really even know what Under Armour is, so I can't answer that question. But I wear underpants most of the time, so. What is Under Armour? Deodorant, I think. Oh, it is? Oh, fucking gym attire. Yeah. No, I've never fucked with Under Armour. Gym attire. Or deodorant, for that matter. Last time I took a clean right hook to the jaw, I think it was in London, like a long time ago, and I got fucking rocked. It's hectic. It's been a minute, it's 10 years for sure at least. Have I ever had a concussion? I've had three or four concussions, I think. Might be why my uh, memory's not so good. What's it like to see everyone turning pro around the same time? I think it's sick. Get to turn pro, it's a dream for everyone that's skating, so. I'm stoked for everyone that does it, man. It's a freaking sick thing. Do my kids skate? Yeah, they skate, they bike ride, they chase chickens, they climb trees, they dig holes, they do all that kid shit. They're kids. Favorite Australian skateboarder has to be Kale Nusk, Jim Ferguson, Sammy Winter. Matt Mumford, Dustin, there's shitloads of sick ones. Do I miss the people at Cliche? I do, I miss the squad from Cliche. It was a super sick time period, it was 10 years. Um, Al Bogger was the man, same with Jeremy Dacklin, and going on trips with Lucas and JB and JJ in the early Cliche days was like pretty sick. What's the worst part about being in a van with Manchild? Nothing, Manchild rules a life. He's the Actually, he's pretty turd on the piss, but he's really funny, so it's, in turn, it's great. I love being in the van with my child. You're all manchy. Would I ever shave my head? Did it one time, solo, in Leon. I was 19, and I bicked my head when I was drunk, and immediately regretted it. Do I skate tight trucks or loose trucks? Probably tight to most people, but to me, because I'm fat, they're quite loose, so I'd say medium, medium loose. Front crook, back crook, flip in, flip out. Front crook, flip out, because you can't flip in. You can hardly flip out, so what, take what you get. You know? <laughs> How many tries did it take me to trade for the bench at Beebles Park? I think the first one I did was like eight goes, and then the second one that didn't suck was shitloads. It was like an hour and a half, probably. What's it like having Benny Fairfax as a brother-in-law? It's tight, he's a scumbag. And we own Wailed Wheels together, so it's sick. I can talk mad shit to him and he has to deal with it. Who has longer hair, me or Jesus? And who can Ollie hire? Jesus has longer hair and can probably Ollie hire, but he doesn't exist, so I have longer hair and I can Ollie hire. <laughs> Thanks, Gay Warehouse. <laughs>